Hello and welcome to another video in the series Learning to Drive with Gary Phillips. In this video we're going to look at open and closed junctions and how to deal with them. So we'll start off with an open junction. An open junction is where as you approach the junction you start to be able to see to the right and to the left because there aren't any obstructions. So I'd imagine it's totally clear, uh, maybe grass on this side and that side, where you can see quite clearly to the right and the left as you uh, approach the junction. If you can see, then you can start to assess the traffic and see if there's going to be a chance for you to emerge without needing to stop. So if it's clear, we'd select the correct gear, which if the fastest you'd probably be able to go is going to be second gear speed, about 10 miles an hour, safely. So we select the gear, bring the clutch up, and if it's still clear as you get to the junction, then you can emerge without needing to stop. When we talk about not stopping, it's not always going to be second gear. Uh, sometimes we can keep moving, but it's going to be first gear. And sometimes the vision's not too good from back here, but as you get a bit closer to the junction, it starts to open up there. So we'd slow down in relation to what vision we've got. And as we slow down, you might then start to see a little bit easier uh, as you get towards the mouth of the junction. And if it starts to become open in both directions, you might be able to go into first gear and check right and left twice before you go over the giveaway line. If it is safe, then we can keep moving, but this time it would be in first gear. It just avoids a complete stop. Closed junctions are slightly different because you can't see until you get right to the end of the junction. So in general, when you come to a closed junction, uh, whether it's on one side or the other, uh, it's a closed junction, then you're going to need to pause at the end. So imagine we've got these buildings here, which go right up to the end of the junction, which means that we can't see enough onto the road that we're joining to make a decision about whether we need to, uh, about whether we can go or not. So as we come up to it, you slow down in relation, in relation to that vision, uh, prepared to stop and slip it into first gear so that you're ready to use that gear to emerge. But pause beho behind the giveaway line. If you still can't see, maybe there's some parked cars, so that obstructs your vision. You might need to use peep and creep as it shows with this blue car here. So peep and creep means that you just go slowly forwards and stop and slowly forwards and stop again, just a couple of inches at a time until it gives you better vision past the obstructions uh, and you can make a good decision as to whether you can go or not. So closed junctions, you're usually going to pause behind the line, look both ways twice, see if it's clear. If it still isn't very good vision, use peep and creep to move out until you can see enough and then you can make a decision to emerge. And that's open and closed junctions.